Hello, we're just doing a quick video to show off the Smith's Crypt daggers because I've been seeing a lot of people saying that they're god awful, but actually they're just really weirdly scaled. Uh, they work very similarly to the Erdsteel dagger, so for whatever reason, they get damage even if you set them to intelligence or magic or sacred or flame art or whatever you do. So you want to be putting a lot of points in intelligence or faith when using these because it increases the physical and the elemental damage at the same time. And then that opens you up to using things like the magic scorpion charms or the physics that boost your elemental damage. And so then you get pretty decent numbers. It's still not incredible, but you are a ranged character. Um, the best thing to use with it is the scattershot throw. It is, I believe, somewhere in the underbridge of Rao. It's kind of hard to describe. I'll try and show on the map here. Actually, now that I think about it, it's somewhere like under this bridge. There should be a scarab beetle somewhere in the area, and that is where you kill the bait you kill the beetle you get the ash war and there you go so here's just a good example with no buffs of how much damage this does pretty decent i would say i mean that's quite significant and the fp cost is fairly low so about three four casts 44 mana not bad um i did notice as well that the jump attacks seem to be able to travel further than the normal attacks for some reason I do believe if there's any buff that these knives need, it's definitely more range, but as you can see, this is about the damage doing. I can't dodge very well, but... And then this is with jump attacks. If you do manage to hit the target in the head, you'll also do bonus damage. It's kind of hard to do it sometimes, depending on the enemy, but... It does also stagger and do, I think it's nearly like 50% more or something like that whenever you hit the target in the head. So there you go. Uh, I'd say they're worth giving a try. In the Shadow of the Earth Tree area, when you have a lot of Skadu fragments, you definitely do a lot more damage. But in the, just even in the normal game, you can do pretty pretty decent damage with these. So yeah, give them a try.